I'm going to be making uh, a sorbet, well a fruity sorbet, I, actually I call it a fruity ice cream, right? So it's really easy, all you need are just, uh, I've only got two ingredients here, frozen bananas, which I, sli I sliced up my bananas and I froze them in my freezer, and some frozen blueberries, that's it, frozen bananas and frozen blueberries. Okay, so what I do is, uh, as you know, the Thermomix has got the cookie dough function, so we can search for recipes, etc. But it also has a manual function, and I'm not going to use this one. I'm going to use the third screen over here, which has the function called blend. Okay, so I'm going to use this particular function. It's called blend over here, the bottom left corner. And what I do is I just chuck all this in. There we go. And... I click on the function blend and I will just press this button, please select time. So by default it goes to 30 seconds, so it's fine, I'll be able to hear it, you'll be able to hear the difference actually. So I just click on this button here and then I just turn, that's all I have to do. That was only about, uh, I think maybe 12 seconds only, but I want to see what it looks like. I'm sure you heard the difference. And look at it already. It's starting to take shape. So I'm just going to push all these a little bit down so that you don't waste any bits which have flown up to the top. Mm -hmm. Oh, such a pretty colour. Okay. okay. And then I'm just going to go for another couple of seconds. Maybe I will, I think I'll just put maybe 15 seconds now. Right, and I go again. I just go to speed seven. I can Okay, and it's done. Look at that. Oh, can you see my bowl has frosted up at the sides as well? That's how cold it is. I, oh, it is cool. I feel like putting it to my neck on such a hot day. Actually, let me take this out for you. I'll scoop it out and you can look at the texture. Look at that. Oh, look at that. So I'm just going to take a little bit and then you can see how smooth it is. Look at that. Just fresh fruit. Mmm. Mmm. So good. Mmm. So good on a hot day. But I have to put this in the top of when put back in the freezer because I can't finish everything. The family will have some later. See you next time. Okay, so just now I made the uh, ice cream with uh, frozen bananas and frozen blueberries. So you can use any fruit. You can use strawberries, raspberries. The, the berries give a nice color. You can also use mango. Um, and yeah, you can use basically whatever fruit. To make it creamy, you do need a banana as well though. So these are options for you if you just want something very healthy, very fast, very quick. Uh, and no sugar, no added preservatives, no added sugars. If you want to make things like chocolate ice cream, uh, vanilla ice cream, magnums. Yes, you can even make your own magnums. I've made them before. Uh, you can also go online, hunt for recipes in the basic cookbook. There are tons of recipes, right? So you need to play around with your machine. Get the fruit that you like and make your own ice cream. Bye!